car is sitting inside the Ford with a Super Gen running, and right now we're running at roughly 5 volts and roughly 10 amps. And as you can see, sitting here idling, this is an air fuel digital mixture gauge. It gives you the rough air fuel mixture. It's controlled off the O2 sensor and also off of the computer of the vehicle. And as you can see, the unit is turned on. And right now, we're staying down in the normal and below normal averages for fuel. Because when it gets up to the high mark, you'll it'll peg all the way to the top. Here, I'll give it a hard mash of gas to make it rich. And as you can see, even mashing it with the gas, it only went up to the second yellow mark above normal. It never reached the red band, the red top two bands for super rich under load. So we'll hit it again. And as you can see, it just goes to the yellow bands over normal. Slightly rich. That's it. And once I take my foot out of it, as you can see, the fair fuel mixture goes all the way down to the bottom into the lean category. So the HHO Gen is controlling the air fuel mixture by supplementing the gasoline and keeping the air fuel mixture in a lean state because it's being substituted by HHO and the O2 sensor is able to read that, regulate the fuel, and keep the fuel air ratio down below normal as much as physically possible. And the only time it goes above normal is when you step into the gas, but then it doesn't go all the way up to the very top on the rich mark. It only goes a yellow hash or two above normal for fuel consumption on the richness of the air fuel mixture. And that's about how it works. Uh, you can get these gauges uh, on the internet or you can order them from us at MagDrive on our website in our product catalog list. And as you can see right now we're running approximately oh, 10 amps right now. As you can see right there between 10 and 15 amps and we're turned on right at the moment and everything is staying down there below normal on fuel consumption and that's what you want to see because right now the gasoline is being subsidized by hydrogen and oxygen or HHO keeping it down into the mildly to full lean area as it's being compensated by the hydrogen output on the superjet and that's about it so I hope this is a little informative you take care, bye-bye, and thank you.